Shah is talking to another video at Movement Mechanics and welcome to another video at the top 4 exercise series and today we want to talk about an important muscle of the posterior chain and one of the biggest threaded muscles in your back which is the trapezius. Now if you are a fast bowler like Brett Lee, Cheswick Bumra or Mitchell Stark or any other greatest fast bowler in the world you need to have good shoulder strength and good and healthy shoulders as well. Now if you want to have healthy shoulders you need to have healthy scapula and when we talk about healthy scapula we have to talk about the trapezius muscle because the trapezius muscle is directly related to the scapula's movement. Now the trapezius muscle has been distributed into three parts which we are going to understand in a bit and this muscle has to do lots of work with the scapula. So let's understand the anatomical aspect which is a tradition before we get into the practicality of this video. Alright, for the anatomy of the trapezius muscle, the trapezius muscle has been distributed in the three parts, the upper trapezius, the medial trapezius and the lower trapezius. Now the upper trapezius does scapular elevation, the, the medial trapezius does scapular retraction and the lower trapezius does scapular depression. Now when I, may, when I mean elevation that means the scapula is elevated whenever you are doing any sort of movement such as the full flexion of your shoulder joint. At this time the scapula is elevated and this elevation is done with the help of the upper trapezius. When I mean retraction the scapula is brought together that means retracted the chest out position is called as scapular retraction this is done with the help of the medial trapezius and when i say depressed the scapula is depressed that means goes down whenever you are carrying any weight or your shoulder is depressed like this that is where the scapular depression happens and this depression is done with the help of the lower trapezius muscles now in this video i am going to give you this four exercise which i am going to target all these three different muscle groups of the trapezius so that you get maximum benefits and healthy scapula which is which in turn is linked with the healthy shoulder so the first exercise which we are going to look to target your trapezius is a dumbbell stroke now the dumbbell stroke is going to do scapular elevation and hence it is going to target that upper trapezius muscle now this this particular exercise can be done with the help of a barbell or a dumbbell but if you want to gain more hypertrophic changes and isolate that scapular elevation muscles which is your upper trapezius then it should be done with the help of a dumbbell and also it allows more free range so that you get maximum benefits when it comes to the range aspect as well as the hypertrophic changes aspect with the help of a dumbbell Secondly, we want to talk about an upright row. Now, the upright row can be done with the help of a cable. I personally love it doing with the help of a cable because it gives us more stability and hence whenever stability comes into the picture, it gives more muscle fiber activation. Now, the upright row is going to engage all the three muscle groups of the trapezius, the lower, the middle, as well as the upper trapezius. Of course, it is going to be much more of a upper trapezius dominant exercise because you are going to pull it, pull the row up over here. That is where the upper trapezius is going to come into the picture. But always, the the medial as well as the lower trapezius muscle is also going to get involved over here so that you get maximum benefits in the all three trapezius muscle groups thirdly we need to talk about an important aspect of the scapula which is scapular retraction and when we talk about scapular retraction it is the medial trapezius muscle which is going to do scapular retraction and no better exercise to do for scapular retraction is a face pull now doing a face pull is very good for engaging your medial trapezius and once that medial trapezius gets engaged that means you are going to have healthy scapular retraction and scapular retraction is very important for maintaining good posture and avoiding kyphosis and maybe you are an athlete or fast bowler or a generic person posture is a basic necessity and you need to have healthy scapular retraction so that you do not undergo kyphosis Finally, I'm going to give you an important exercise for engaging the lower traps, which means you are going to do scapular depression. Now, this exercise, which is a prone Y, is going to help you to engage the lower traps by doing scapular depression. Now, scapular depression is also an important part for ma maintaining the functions of the scapula. Hence, strengthening the lower traps with the help of a prone Y is going to give you that scapular depression. And if you want healthy scapular depression, which is necessary for various sort of exercises and various sort of movements in the human body, then you should do a prone Y so that you have got the strength in the lower trapezius muscles in order to do that scapular depression. So if you are a fast bowler or if you are a thrower like Neeraj Chopra, then you need to have healthy shoulders as I've mentioned in my previous videos as well. So if you want to have healthy shoulders, you need to have healthy scapula. And this video is going to give you the top 4 exercises which are going to make your scapula healthy. Now, if you have loved this video, make sure you hit the like, the share, the subscribe, as well as the notification bell icon so that you never miss a video when I am uploading a new one. Also, if you have got any doubts and comments regarding this video or any other video suggestions which you want to cover in the future, make sure you drop that in the comment section. Alright guys, see you in the next one.